We've been telling you about this week, but one of the recipients of funds distributed to nonprofits by the Sony Open in Hawaii and Friends of Hawaii Charities is Aloha Harvest. Here to tell us about their mission and the launch of a new program, we welcome Executive Director Phil Acosta. So nice to have you on the program. Hi, thank you for having me. Absolutely. Well, tell us about Aloha Harvest and what's been happening. Sure. Uh, we've been around since 1999, and we are the only uh, food rescue organization in Hawaii. And so uh, we're similar to other food programs uh, that, that does feeding and things like that, except uh, we're unique in that we focus on food waste. And so we mm. work with uh, restaurants, hotels, uh, grocery stores, things that they can't resell or maybe near expiration. And we collect that and we re redistribute, redistribute it to the uh, community. Such a great and needed program. And how has that really advanced over the past 20 years and what you've been able to do and how many people you've been able to touch? Sure. Uh, like I said, you know, over 20 years now, uh, we've rescued over 23 million pounds of wow. food, diverting that from the landfill. Mm. And, you know, really putting that where the need is, where folks are hungry or maybe food insecure. And that also helps with the uh, reduce the impact to the environment. And I know you have a new program yes. and you're excited about yes, that. Very much. Uh, so we're, we'll be launching iRescue, um, Okina AI Rescue. So yeah. it's a bit of a play on words, I as in food, AI as in uh, uh, artificial intelligence, so using uh, a new technology and a web application, and also from the, uh, the volunteers' perspective where they can participate in the uh, food rescue mission. And that's great. So definitely be on the lookout for that. And looking forward, we are about to close a year here. I know the goal setting starts for 2020 and beyond that. What does Aloha Harvest have up its sleeves? Well, uh, we have our, we'll be celebrating our 20th uh, anniversary in April. Um, April Congratulations. 18th, yes, at the Hokupu Center. So for those folks that want to be a part of that, definitely check us out on, on, on our website. We'll have more information up there. All right. And with the Sony Open, of course, coming in in January, and that you said they've been a big supporter. So that's terrific. What are you able to do with those funds? Sure. Uh, well, first off, I well, you know, wanted to uh, thank Friends of Hawaii Charities mm -hmm. and the Sony Open, the organizers of uh, Sony Open in Hawaii. They've been tremendous supporters of us over the, the past years. And, you know, we... We aim to provide and continue to provide the service that we do free of charge. So free of charge to the donors, free of charge to the partner agencies. And so with the help of uh, these uh, charitable foundations, they can help us to continue to do that. And that is terrific. Think about that. Sony Open coming up, a lot of exposure, attention on Hawaii, but the good they're doing in community. We've talked to other nonprofits throughout the week, such as Honolulu Habitat for Humanity. So they continue to give back their friends of Hawaii charities. And how can people support Aloha Harvest if they have a heart to give? Sure. So uh, for anybody out there that uh, wants to be involved, whether as a donor, as a partner agency, or a volunteer, uh, you know, check us out on our website, aloharvest.org. Or follow us on social media at Aloha Harvest. Uh, we'll have some information in there and how you can get involved, how you can donate your time, and uh, you know uh, things like that, and be part of the food rescue mission. Phil, it's terrific, and thank you so much, and happy holidays to oh, you. Same to you. We'll post all this on KHON2.com.